channel I'm Savannah if you're new here today I am in Kauai I'm actually sitting in a Zen garden right now but that's a story I'll tell you later I'm visiting my friend here um, she came to me on the big island and I kind of showed her around for a couple days and now I'm here it's just a very short trip but I'm so excited because I get to see the island through her eyes and so I'm just so excited yeah so let's go going yep oh i sound like an idiot because <laughs> i forgot my camera and this hike is so cool and oh my, my phone God. is dying and so we did a tiny bit of the hike <laughs> and then decided to truly. come back <laughs> and we've been drinking a little bit so now we're stuffing our faces it was our hike intermission <laughs> but also we kind of needed to waste time to, to be able to we're waiting here. for the sunset so, so we're playing who's a tourist <laughs> But it's not very hard. <laughs> Everyone's a tourist here. <laughs> it's like people watching in a cafe, you know? Mm -hmm. Sorry, I kind of have to be quiet because my friend's still sleeping, but it was easily one of the coolest hikes I've ever done. It was so pretty. It kind of took us next to the Nepali coast, which I did last time I was here, but we did it on a boat tour, and it was just stunning. The sun started going down. It was incredible. Um, but today we're going to spend more of our time up on North Shore and go to a few beaches, which I'm really excited about. So yeah, it's just like a super short trip. I'm just here for two nights, but... I'm so excited. We kind of are just like trying to squeeze in as much as we can um, while I'm here. Kind of like what we did when she visited Big Island. So anyway, it's awesome here. I'm getting so sad to leave Hawaii. And this is definitely not helping. <laughs> I'm moving back to California in a few weeks. So I'm getting really sad about leaving Hawaii. <laughs>
off to the camera. Hey guys, we got it. What do you rate this beach? One out of ten. I mean, one to ten. Uh, I would say it's about like a nine point five. No, this is like crazy. All right, what was your rating? What happens? <laughs> this is so. I'm all alone. I dropped my friend off at some dinner and I'm gonna go to the Hanalei Pier for sunset and I just got like a little wrap and a huge bag of cherries because I didn't want to find someplace else. I thought they still would have hot food but they didn't so. It is so beautiful here. It's insane. Okay, this looks pretty good. There's like this pier here and a lot of kids jump off it. And I just went and walked down. And I like kind of wish I had my bathing suit on, but I also like, I was at the beach all day and am like a little bit over being wet and salty. So I was just like watching them. It looks pretty fun though. This feels crazy. It's so beautiful here. Like stunning. It doesn't feel real. Good morning. I am in a Zen garden right now. My friend Sophia lives like next to it and she kind of like takes care of the garden it's so beautiful here and usually you can see the mountains over there a little bit better but it's just so pretty and there's a little pond over there it's just stunning it's crazy um today is my last morning here in Kauai we are gonna go to Queen's Bath I think I tried to go last time I was here sorry if it's windy but it was closed because I think during the winter just the swells get too big and then it's kind of dangerous. So we're gonna try to do that today and then I fly out at 2 p.m. But this has been seriously so much fun. Yesterday we got to go to this beach. No one was on it and um, we had it all to ourselves. And then we went and checked out this surf spot that totally reminded me of um, a spot in Hilo that I always go to. And then I went to the Hanalei Pier and I just like watched sunset because she had a dinner. But 
This is just reminding me how much I love and miss traveling. I really, really want to be able to travel more, especially like in this upcoming year or two, or years, I don't care, or my life. There's just like something so special about it. Meeting new people, seeing new places, experiencing other cultures and just ways of living. It really opens your eyes and kind of pops your reality bubble. I feel like it's so easy to like live your life and think that that's like normal and that there's not much more to offer but there is so much more to offer. I don't know, it makes me happy. Goal for the next year or two, travel more. Anyway, I'm gonna sip on my coffee that I got yesterday. I just had some left. I'm just gonna sit here. I didn't bring my phone and I'm just gonna chill until Sophia wakes up.